In contrast with usual cases of solitary toxic nodules, the intact right lobe in this patient is not decreased. It is explained by the fact that the patient was euthyroid until the iodine contamination four months before the investigation. The toxic nodule in the left lobe is inhomogeneous. The vascularization is decreased. We locate the nodule in the central field of vision. The tip of the needle is not seen, but the movement of the needle can be visualized. At first, we gave only a minimal test amount of alcohol. The first signs of alcohol spread prove that we are very close to, or even outside the ventral surface of the nodule. Therefore we had to insert the needle deeper. Now, we are in the right depth and can start with alcohol injection.